Now, News Extra here on KNEB, brought to you by Pinnacle Bank, Mitchell and Torrington, the way banking should be. Here's Kevin Mooney. Thank you, Dennis. Good morning, everyone. Our guest today on News Extra, Dr. George Slothauer, is here, along with Pastor Richard Neugebauer from uh, Faith Lutheran Church. And uh, we're going to talk about a a wonderful walk that they're uh, doing uh, tomorrow, uh, the 10th annual Walk for the Community by uh, Faith Lutheran Church. And uh, this year they're going to do it for uh, Birthright. Proceeds go into Birthright. Uh, Pastor, you guys, like I said, you've done this for uh, 10 years. You you chose Birthright. Why did you choose Birthright? Because we felt that that uh, meets a tremendous need for those who uh, are pregnant, who would like to keep their child, but maybe don't have the, some of the things that are needed to see that happen. And Birthright actually started in the late 1960s, so they've been around a while, always having the concern of the mother and the child. And so they focus on them and uh, try to have a cupboard and things full so that uh, those needs can be met for those who need it. All right, that's very good. And uh, proceeds stay right here in the panhandle, am I right? Yes, uh, this year, um, since the local one has closed, it will be our extended community in Shadron. Uh, They will be the recipients of what is raised here. But uh, that will also impact us here because they serve the needs here as well. Yeah, so if uh, we need some uh, money here, it'll it'll come back to Scott's Bluff. All right, uh, Doc. You've uh, uh, they've got about what uh, you've got about what twenty eight hundred uh, crosses on display on the on the church lawn right now. Yes, we do. Um, in connection with uh, our our stand on uh, right to life, we now have twenty eight hundred crosses on our lawn at Faith Lutheran Church in Gearing, and each cross represents uh, an abortion that takes place in the United States uh, daily. And so this is a representation of those abortions that we hope to uh, prevent. And birthright is an opportunity for a woman to to have another option besides uh, uh, an abortion. Yeah, for uh, distressed mothers and the and the baby, and just uh, to kind of help them out with uh, maybe what they have as a difficult situation, right? Correct. Okay. All right. So you guys uh, have this walk tomorrow. It starts uh, over at the church. And then it goes uh, over to Scotts Bluff National Monument, right? Yes, it does. Uh, the the uh, walk, actually, uh, registration is at 8.30. The, the walk is at 9 o'clock. Uh, and with your $20 registration, you get a T-shirt, and you get to walk to the monument property uh, up to the, uh, the, uh, the uh, headquarters. Uh, if you f- feel that you only want to walk uh, to the headquarters and not back, uh, you have an opportunity to get a ride back after the walk. All right. And, uh, Pastor, you were displaying uh, just now for the video that we'll have on on Facebook here in just a little bit, the T-shirt that you get for the $20 uh, entry fee, right? Yes, and we're excited that uh, Mary Hunt developed the design for our T-shirt. Uh, this is our 10th walk that we're doing, and so it's nice to um, come up with a new design for our shirts and like they always do, they have the sponsors on the back as well. And we, we thank them uh, for, again, stepping up to the plate and helping us to have a successful walk. Yeah, it's a very nice T-shirt. It really is. So uh, you get that T-shirt with your uh, $20 that uh, you give in order to do the walk. We'll uh, take a break, uh, talk about some of the people that are sponsoring this, some more information about the walk tomorrow right after this. Secure your peace of mind with Pinnacle Bank's new checking account, the Diamond Secure account. With it, you'll get all the great features of our checking accounts along with identity theft protection and cellular telephone protection. For complete details of this checking account, speak with the bank representative. Open a new Diamond Secure account in branch or at wypinbank.com. To switch your current checking account, visit your local branch in Mitchell or Torrington. Pinnacle Bank, member FDIC. Insurance products are not insured by FDIC or any federal government agency. Not a deposit of or guaranteed by the bank or any bank affiliate. Back on News Extra, we have Dr. George Slothauer here, Pastor Richard Neugebauer from Faith Lutheran Church, the 10th annual Walk for the Community coming up tomorrow morning, and uh, registration at 8.30 over at Faith Lutheran Church at 2055 U Street in Gearing. The walk then starts at 9 o'clock over to Scotts Bluff National Monument. It's $20. 
You get a T-shirt with the walk, and this year uh, it's a walk for birthright and uh, to help uh, mothers and uh, depre- depressed mothers, distressed mothers and their baby think about other options other than abortion. Uh, Pastor, you uh, uh, have a number of sponsors, a number of people that have already helped you out, given some money, sponsored the walk, right? Uh, let's talk about some of those folks. Yeah, our sponsors this year are UCT. That stands for United Commercial Travelers. It's a nonprofit insurance that has a wonderful benefit division that gives money to different projects and communities. We have the Garing Garden Center, uh, a group of families, Dixon, Hessler, Meissner, Neugebauer. We also have Dr. George and Barbara Schlothauer, who again are our sponsors. Uh, Garing Kiwanis Club, the Sint Family, True Green, uh, uh, Anonymous Gift in Memory of Emily, the Garing Dental Clinic with Dr. Mark Schlothauer, uh, Lana House Painting with Dusty Lana and the Haddon Family. So we once again give thanks to all of our sponsors. Yeah, you've had, uh, and boy, you guys have done a great job in raising money over the nine years prior to this, and I'm sure it'll be just as big a success this uh, tenth year. Every year, you're raising well over two thousand, sometimes three thousand dollars for uh, for whoever you're going to raise it for, right? Yes, uh, we've been very pleased. Our goal with this is to uh, increase awareness among our own members of the the needs that our local community has. And um, so I just want to give a shout out to the members of Faith. Uh, They've always done a great job of stepping up to the plate and uh, giving support to some of our local needs. All right. Some of the other things, uh, other uh, organizations they've raised money for, Doves, Buckboard, uh, therapy. They've raised money for uh, uh, the Panhandle Youth Shelter. Um, also, uh, the United Way Day of Caring Food Program, stuff like that. So, uh, very good. Well, we would just like to encourage everybody to come out. It's supposed to be a beautiful day tomorrow. Uh, this is a worthwhile event, and it's a worthwhile um, birthrights. Is definitely something we all need to support. We just want to encourage people to come out, enjoy the beautiful day, and support birthright. All right, starts once again, registration at 8.30, the walk at 9. You walk from the church on U Street over to the monument and then back. They'll have some beverages and snacks provided as well. It's just $20. You get a nice T-shirt, and it's a nice day. There's no Husker game, so it gives you something something to do. Correct. All right. All right, you guys, thank you for coming in. Appreciate it. Well, thank you. It. Thank you, Kevin. You bet. Friday at AgriTalk, we'll wrap up the week with a free-for-all. I'll be joined by Jim Wiesmeyer, John Phipps, and Chip Flory. We'll talk about the presidential campaign, farm bill, trade, and much, much more. Lots of topics and lots of opinions. Be sure to join the conversation Friday on AgriTalk. On the air, online, and streaming live on your mobile device. Radio.